Dear ones, we come again to you with great news. The walls of illusion are falling apart for many humans, and we do not mean only for light workers. The heavens are allowing more and more help to descend onto your planet. This is either to be born as physical humans, and also to help answer your prayers from the beyond. There is much joy in heaven in our hearts over the global state of awakening of the human race. This takes place and manifests in your thoughts, hearts and feelings. We are aware of the change as this affects you in a great manner. We see that many of you take more and more into consideration the well-being and happiness of other human beings upon your planet. Many of you wish to stop wars, to end hunger and poverty, and to see a better and fairer world for all to be born and come into shape. We wish to be part of this change, and to help you hold your decision of making your planet a better and happier place, part of our great Traga Cosmos or as you call it, the Great Multiverse. The physics and rational behind the world is very complex, but we have been trying to sum it up for you in one word over the years. That word is love, and simple love. All humans have access to the gift of love no matter what gender, nationality or what your wealth is. All of you have a heart, but the heart is sometimes in a frozen state, or a state of stasis, similar to sleep. It has been working in an incorrect way for many years and many generations, as a result it no longer knows its power and how many miracles can be performed with it. We see many of you gaining the power of their heart from above, and this manifests in many different ways upon your planet. Compassion, understanding, and willingness to help another living being are blooming in your heart again dear ones, thus the reason for our rejoicing. The other consequence of the awakening of love on earth is that many twin flames are coming to see each other for the first time and are considering uniting again. Twin flames are ancient souls that have agreed to incarnate apart, on different planets for millennia, in order to grow at the maximum speed and to increase their wisdom. In many occasions they incarnate together on the same planet and help one another from all levels of existence. Sometimes they live side by side for many years, but do not know who they are from one another. This precise point in time helps them reunite again on the higher realms at first, which leads to the physical reunion when everything has been properly orchestrated from above. We are glad to see them do their work of purging and uniting as they have set to do upon your planet. They are also part of our ground crews and we cherish them very much, because we know the pain and suffering that they have accepted to undergo for this Earth Ascension mission, and they have done so willingly, renouncing a very comfortable position of trust from our Creator. We recommend that you keep informed of what is going on in the outer world, but try to maintain a contact with your inner being and feelings at least a few times during your day. We realize that the obstacles to doing that are incredibly great, but try to find a few moments of peace throughout your day, the best time to do so is in the morning, when you are taking your meals and drink, and in the evening at sunset. The energy of sunset holds a very special resonance that will sustain your efforts in awakening during your day. The same goes for the time of the day when the sun rises in your sky. Its magnificence and power will help restore a sense of peace in your heart. We love you very much. Thank you.